A former royal butler has disclosed that Prince William and Princess Kate used to go out to ordinary locales to have covert dates when they were in the early stages of their relationship, despite the fact that the Prince and Princess of Wales have been together for more than 20 years, sequences from the Netflix series The Crown represent the moments when the Prince and Princess first became romantically involved. William and Kate first became acquainted with one another while they were both pursuing their undergraduate degrees at St. Andrews University in Scotland. Both William and Kate were majoring in art history at the time, but William would subsequently switch his major to geography, however, the couple's parallels went beyond the subject matter that they were studying. Both of them had grown up in their respective home counties, attended exclusive boarding schools, and maintained relationships with members of very high society. A former royal butler disclosed that the couple used to sneak out for secret dates in order to get to know each other. It is therefore not surprising that the couple would eventually become husband and wife, as well as the future king and queen. However, it is surprising that the couple would eventually become husband and wife, Grant Harold, in an interview with Slingo.com, expressed his fondness for the couple's covert meetings that took place during the early stages of their relationship. He said, I remember them ordering curries to the house and organizing secret cinema trips. I remember going to the local pub when they were living in Tetbury, and Kate and William were just sitting there having a drink. I was there when they were there. We had a pleasant conversation. They were so typical and similar to any other couple in the world. Also, the locals simply did not bother them at all. Furthermore, Mr. Harold provided an explanation of William's romantic inclination in relation to Kate, saying, William is a romantic at heart. During the celebration of Valentine's Day, he asked me to assist him in preparing a supper for Kate that would be lighted with candles. They had just been engaged and were on the verge of being married when they celebrated Valentine's Day. Being a part of it made me extremely thrilled. Although I am unable to recall the specifics of what was served, I am confident that William selected Kate's preferred dessert. He possesses a romantic side to him. Since the pair has been married, they have three children, and they have increased their obligations to the firm, Mr. Harold claims that their impulsive tendency has had to decrease. However, he also observes that the couple still manages to sneak in some of the fun that they had when they were dating young, the duties that come with being the future king and queen are more mature and they have grown up. They take it very seriously, but it forces them to be more cautious when it comes to the things that they do on a daily basis, such as going out to the pub or going on dates. When they are able to, however, I will wager that they continue to go to the movies in secret. The connection between the Prince of Wales and the Princess of Wales is the primary focus of the narratives in the final episodes of The Crown, which the streaming service Netflix made available today.